All right, we're gonna start here in the front. Batteries. Batteries have been sitting here since 2015, 2016, I should say. It's like brakes, starters. Still in the box. Miscellaneous parts up here. Rebuilt starters, alternators. down into the back area where all the parts are. Still a lot of batteries here, motorcycle batteries. Some of these look like they are school bus, starters, alternators. Several chargers, more batteries, electronics. I think there's really a whole lot back here. This is the office. Let's go back into the shop area where all the parts are. We're going to take a right to this area first. Just going to slowly scan through some of these. Open the file cabinet. Solenoids, coils. boxes still have new or rebuilt starters and solenoids or uh, alternators in them. All right, so that was that area. Let's scan through this area real quick.
more alternators. Rectifiers, staters. Armatures. That was the right side. Now we're gonna, before we came in, we're gonna go to the left. Not as many over here, but there are a lot. And some machinery. to be new. Check to see. I'm pretty sure these are full. It's getting back over here. All kind of parts. Might be a lot of parts you've been trying to order. You can't order online because they're out. Now we're gonna go back to the beginning. So we scanned that area, that whole area. So let's now let's go a little bit further back. So we pass by these parts bins, mostly just bolts. A workbench area. Chrysler insulator. I'm not sure what that is. Parts. 
starter kits. Trying to scan these slow enough, so if you want to pause it, look up parts. Don't know what it would take to palletize all this and ship it. So I'm really kind of targeting some local or in-state companies that kind of do the same thing this one did, but not opposed to trying to ship it out. More parts, lugs. Heat shrink, a lot of parts manuals. So we've gone through this first section. Let's look at some of the machinery. Looks like that's just a place to clean stuff. Anything in here but the bathroom and some janitorial. More alternators. Yep, they're in there. All right. Just invoices, those aren't parts. Some of these are definitely parts. Starter armatures. Gonna give you a quick view back of the shelves. Sure, these are empty. Yep, those are empty. Now let's rotate to the middle section of shelving. Armatures. Housings. lot 
in this last section. This one box has got a lot of miscellaneous parts also. All right, let's go down this shelf. The staters. Now we're going to take rotate around. I don't have the power on in here. That's why I'm using this light. Hoping to get it on the next within the next week or so. welder. Wire feeder. Another welder. Pedal. I'm not sure what that device is. a machine for creating the coils, spooler. All right, that is the majority of what I wanted to share with you. This was a different shop back here most of it is hobby related airplanes airplane parts things like that but the majority of the shop was alternator and starter rebuild and repair so that is a preview of what you will find here have any questions reach out and I will try my best to answer them we are looking for a purchaser to buy the bulk of all of the inventory parts and machinery that was used for the business Can't guarantee that every part will be here, every piece of machinery will be here, but we will negotiate. So let me know if you have any questions or interest or if you need specific pictures or videos of anything you saw in this video, and I will do my best to get it to you. I'm only gonna be available for a few more days in the area. So hopefully this will suffice. Thanks.